See you. an acclaimed fashion designer and she's one of the world's most famous supermodels and together they co-host the new season of Bravo's hit series the fashion show ultimate collection take a look before you begin you will meet with my co-host and lead judge the incomparable Isaac Mizrahi using mood boards and sketches you will present your house's vision to him so head up to your workspace name your fashion house and get started I expect to be wowed. Please welcome fashion icon Iman and Isaac Mizrahi. A bathroom in the Hamptons That's right. at the home of Dennis Basso. That's right, it was a I, I had to go and yeah, yeah. You were going in the bathroom to do what I was doing just before. <laughs> yeah, yeah. And I peeing. don't want to know. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> no, no, no. no, but it's it's great to have you back and it's great to have you here. I feel like I know both of you even beyond like interviewing and stuff because I watch both of you sell stuff on TV. Yes, that's right. And just cute, just and very enterprising. To both of you, congratulations on this second season of, of the show. The show. It's a great thing. Thank you. Wendy, I'm mesmerized by the jewelry. He was standing with I'm me like, outside the bathroom at Dennis Basso's house. I know. Look at that. 12 years. I earned it. You know how that is. And okay. where's your ring? No, you... I, I'm wearing a global chic ring. Oh, that's so. from Hawaii. Oh. This is not as expensive. <laughs> However, your real ring, as I can recall, yes. is yeah. one giant yeah. ten yeah. carat ice cube. Yes. Mm -hmm. yes. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Mm -hmm. That's good. <laughs> Listen, so, um, all right, first, like I said, congratulations on this second season. Both of you are fashion icons, and we've always enjoyed um, each of you individually, so this season's going to be great. And I love Kelly Rollins, and I know that she was the co-host last season, mm -hmm. but Kelly is not fashion. <laughs> well, she has a different perspective. She brought a completely different perspective to the show, yeah. you know? It, it is. It really has nothing to do that Kelly was not good or anything. Right. It's just a different perspective. Exactly. Right. That's, right. Yeah. That's right. But I like the perspective of, uh, of me. Of, yeah. <laughs> well, no, it's not even that. Here's the thing. You designed the Listen, clothes? get this. If you walked into a cocktail party right. and Iman was there, uh -huh. you'd go, oh, let me go home and change and restyle <laughs> and everything, right? Yes. She just brings the ante up. I'm sorry. What can I say? It, no, it does. It, it, <laughs> To the God. temperature of the room just gets hotter. Honest to God, hotter. when I knew both of you were coming here today, I said, all right, let me just do something classic <laughs> and chic. I, I went through it. It's like just not any guest. These are fashion people, so I went with the madman. I know. And, 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 and I think it's gorgeous. Really gorgeous. Really gorgeous. Oh, yeah. You know, so you are the madman body. <laughs> thank you. Thank you, Iman. <laughs> also, this new language. Iman. <laughs> It's a big year for you. You know, Iman, everybody, won the Council of Fashion's Designers of America Award. Huge. Huge. There you are at the after party getting down with uh, Tyson Beckford and, oh, and Ooh, Naked Man. I know, I know. Hey, uh, darling, friends of mine, Friends of mine took me to this club called the Boom Boom Room. Oh. And, um, and these two guys presented me this boom fake and award. Boom. And yeah, the boom, so, boom. Yeah. 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 And they were gorgeous, but it was like, I couldn't touch. <laughs> <laughs> and I'm not a party girl. I'm ready to go out. <laughs> that's what they all say. Uh, yeah, exactly. No, but you know, um, that, that's a big deal. I know there, there are a few pe people that we already know who won that award. I think Sarah Jessica Parker yes, won uh, the fashion award. Uh, Nicole Kidman, uh, Nicole. Kate Moss. Yeah. Uh, I don't know. I, I, I'm the fifth, so I yeah. don't know who it's was It's fashion that. icon, right? Fashion, fashion icon. icon. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's a big deal. So that's what I bring to the Bravo show, as a fashion icon. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, and, 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 and P.S., if you haven't seen the commercials, the reason that I do this is because she says, fashion. <laughs> right? Yes, exactly. So now, Isaac, about you. What about me? I, I mean... <laughs> 
you, you and I share a love of Pee Wee Herman. Yes, we do. Yeah. Wait a second. Who doesn't love Pee Wee Herman? Oh, I love Pee Wee. I went to see a show the other night. It was I want to so take great. our son because I know go, it's in town. Go, go, Tell go. Tell us about it. Well, it's just the funniest thing in the world. And all of your favorites are still there Cherry and Terry and Cowboy Globy. Curtis and Globy's there. Yeah, you won't want to miss this. It's so fun. It's the funnest show in the Pee -wee world. Pee Wee has his whole show on Broadway right now. Yeah. And so, was that you guys backstage? Well, yeah. I mean, we, I, somehow, like, a manager said, Oh, would you like to meet? Mr. Rubens, and I was like, who? And, and he, oh, Pee Wee. Right? Yes. So I went downstairs, and there, there it was in the green room. And actually, he, we, we were traversing the lobby to get to the green room, and he was like, oh, you know, one second. And he was wearing, a, like, a shirt. Like, he just took his, he was taking his clothes off, and I was going to see him. He put on another suit, like another, a fresh Glenn Plaid suit, and he appeared as Pee Wee in the green room. It wasn't like... <laughs> Like you'd expect a star yeah, backstage in a robe take or something. Right. You know, like take off. But he actually just went to put on a fresh Glenn Plaid suit. <laughs> so funny. Yeah, a fresh the, suit. The pressures, the pressures to stay thin. Yeah. Um, Why did that come up? Where did that come well, because from? Because we, you know what? I've got a simple. The thing about the show, I've got a simple like seven minutes to say hello. I love your projects. I want to know a little bit about your lives, and then say good luck. I'll be watching tonight. Yeah, yeah exactly. So you know, obviously being a supermodel. Yeah, and it looks like you were not, you're uh, naturally just... Uh, yeah, I'm naturally thin. Yes. Uh, people from my country, Somalia, are really naturally thin. So yes. this is really genes. Lucky mom and dad, you know? Uh, very That's nice. it, the pure genes. But as you get, as I get older, you know, I just have to take care of myself cardiovascularly and, you know, and all that. So I really went to Equinox and uh, went to this class called Intensati. Yes. Brilliant. I mean, pools of sweat on the floor. Uh -huh. <laughs> really. People say, like, they say, like, you, uh, you know, sweat 500 calories right so there. So you keep it together. Yeah. Now, Isaac, yes. you and I are in the struggle. What do you we do? I, I, heard I you do Weight Watchers, actually. Okay. Yeah. I mean, I feel like a lifelong member of Weight Watchers. I mean, I've tried other diets, and they work. But for the most part, isn't Weight Watchers the best way to kind of keep it together and actually have a little something good once in a while? I don't know. I mean, like, what can I say? You're always on something. Right? Always. Always on something. It's a tough battle. And the older we get, the our metabolism slows down. Look, we're going to take a quick break, everybody, but we've got more talk with Isaac and Iman about their loves, their lives, and yes, the show tonight on Bravo. <laughs> Did he or didn't he? I want to know, don't you? Thursday, Brett Michaels comes clean about his relationship with Miley Cyrus.